Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Drinking with the Stars. I'm Linda with The Wrap and we're here at the Riviera 31 at the Sofitel Hotel. And today I am drinking with the star of the last five years, Jeremy Jordan. Hey Jeremy. Hi. And I'm World. having a <laughs> vodka cranberry. What are you drinking over there? Uh, this is just a little ginger ale. A little ginger ale. So was this your first leading role in a film? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I did a, I've done a supporting role, but never, yeah, never leading. It's definitely my first leading role in film. I never thought about you that. Know, you didn't think about that while you were filming? You're like, oh God, this is my first No, day. I've never really, I just, because I've done a lot of lead roles on stage, and so I just, like, had kind of, I just kind of Yeah, so what's the in. difference between doing a leading man role on Broadway versus doing it on film? Um, my God, there's a, countless differences, but um, I, I would say, it, you, it doesn't feel like that on film. It just feels like you're just kind of doing your thing and you're kind of just doing uh, your scenes and, and, and sort of living as a character. On stage and on Broadway, you, you feel a sense of leadership. Okay. And like you're leading the cast and uh, you're kind of thrust into a role. Uh, on film, the director is always a leader and, uh, and it's, it doesn't... It doesn't, it doesn't yeah, it doesn't feel like I'm a leader. It just felt like I was just a part of it. It didn't feel like it was on you to really... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, the Strange. film is also unique. Not that It's not that you're just a leading, but it's just you and Anna Kendrick like throughout the whole movie, basically. Yeah, it's just definitely. on the two of you. So yeah. what was that like? Well, it's great because, uh, you know, uh, especially with a musical, which is usually much bigger, it's made it very intimate. And uh, we got to tell a very specific story from beginning to end. Um, and you really got to know these characters and develop them, and uh, it wasn't just like a little snippet, it was really, you got to see everything. And uh, So it was a treat to get to really uh, show all these different sides and aspects of, of one character, you know, mm -hmm. starting out as like sort of affable, young, excited uh, young man uh, who loved everything and everyone, and turning uh, eventually into someone that can cheat on his wife and eventually uh, uh, become sucked into this world of fame and uh, fortune. So do you think that's what happened to Jamie and Kathy? He got a little, you know, full of the fame? And um, the... I think that's part of it, okay. um, but I, I don't think it would have happened if she had been emotionally available to him. Okay. Um, I think you see throughout the movie him trying to sort of booster her up and really trying to uh, to get her to come out of herself because she kind of sinks in and mm -hmm. she just and as his star is rising, hers is not going anywhere, and I, I think it, it it pushes her into a into a darker place, and he's trying to lift her out. And after a while, it's hard to keep doing that every day, constantly, right. and I and I think you know, being in a uh, a world where everybody's much more confident and, and in his work career at least uh, he's surrounded by people who are the opposite of that and it's I'm sure attractive after a while right thanks for joining us for another episode of drinking with the stars Jeremy please tell everyone where they can catch the last five years uh, you can catch the last five years uh, opening this Friday the 13th <laughs> story about it Death. No, I'm kidding. Uh, uh, this Friday 13th in New York and L.A. Uh, it spreads to other theaters uh, throughout the rest of the month. And you can also get it on the 13th on demand on iTunes, uh, on, uh, on, on your cable, or any place that sells uh, newly released on-demand movies. And the soundtrack is out now, too, right? And the soundtrack is out right now. Go get it. And right. only listen to it a couple of times. Also, you know, no spoiler alerts. Okay. Cheers to that. Cheers.